Alright, hello everybody, and welcome to another video today. My name is Chris, and today we're going to be taking a look at the soon-to-be former West Elm store located in downtown Re uh, Reno, Nevada. Uh, it was just announced that this store would be shutting down. Um, I don't know when it's going to be closing, but we'll go through the article uh, first. Nearly a dozen people wandered through West Elm, the furniture home and, and decor store in downtown Reno, Nevada, on Friday afternoon, surrounded by signs advertising a massive going out of business sale. Store closing, the signs read in all caps, 40% off, all sales are final, were printed in big red letters. West Elm, West Elm first opened in Reno in August of 2016, making its home in the 1930s era former United States Post Office building at 50 South Virginia Street. In a move hurdled as a landmark moment for the revitalization of retail in downtown Reno. Uh, you're, not going to, you're, you're not going to recognize downtown for the next year's Reno Mayor uh, Hillary Shiv said in an April 2016 statement to the RGJ uh, story about West Elm's opening. It's a testament to downtown. Big retailers don't pick big cities that are on decline. We're being noticed. More than five years after the retailer is apparently pulling the plug on its Reno investment. A West Elm employee told the RGJ Friday she was not instructed she was instructed not to speak to the media about the closing, which aka she didn't want to be the one to get bad press, so that's probably why West Elm told her to say that. Uh they they were instructed not to speak because I guess it's a company policy that uh West Elm is and they just they just didn't want bad press, which is smart. They're they're trying to protect their ASSs. And I, I actually do respect that. I respect that they're trying to protect their, you know, asses. So uh, voicemails left with the Bernie uh, Car uh, Carter, the owner of the post office, that is also home to the basement on the first floor and office space in the third, not immediately returned for the story on Friday afternoon. Couples browse. This just goes on about people browsing through the store. Large pieces of furniture like sofas, chairs, chest, dra chest of drawers had yellow notes on them declaring sold. Uh, this is the West Elm physical store in that old post office. Customers standing in the checkout line uh, had candles, glassware in their baskets. Um, candles, and this is uh, Shawana Lepi, assistant manager at the, the Coffee, is one of the several locally owned retail shops and food vendors and other businesses housed in the basement downstairs. Said West Elm employees are regulars. She said she's not concerned. Um, about about the store closing, uh, she is not concerned about her store closing because West Elm is closing. I'm very confident in our store. Da 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 da. There's not really much else to see here, but yeah, it's obviously unfortunate people losing their job, and uh, all I gotta say is the best of luck. So, anyways, guys, thank you again for watching this video. Link will be in the description below, and that will be it.